I'm in Richmond Park, just sitting here for a second. I wanted to give you guys a little bit of a channel update. I was uh, visiting my brother Pat yesterday. It was his birthday. I'll tell you how old he is to save my life, but that doesn't matter. And a friend of his has a passion for photography and videography. And we got to talking. He's confident in his uh, video shooting skills. He occasionally does weddings, and other various things he can get his hands on. And he wanted to learn better stills photography. He showed me his camera. He like, lives next to my brother, so it was just a second for him to step over. He's got a nice camera. A little bit newer than the one I'm using right here. Um, so I'm like, yeah, I mean, you want to learn, I'll teach. So. I said either next Saturday or the Saturday after we'll uh, schedule, we'll go to one of the parks by the river and I'll do a vlog of me teaching him how to do basic stills photography. And he likes that idea. He doesn't have a problem being in front of the camera as well as being behind it. And I taught him a few basic things and he was really happy about it. He kind of wants me to join with him for doing some of his events as a second photographer so I might or might not take up some spare money there but um, either next Sunday or the following Saturday I'm gonna film three or four photography lessons with him as a student and I'll release them probably a week apart and we'll go from there but I may do two or three dates like this with them, where we go out and I teach them different tricks, different types of photography, and we'll see how it goes. But for the short term, we'll have a face to my channel. It's going to be the face of my brother's friend Lucas, but that'll be all right with me. Um, he'll be a crash test dummy for vlogging at the same time as I'll be able to share as much of my photography knowledge as I can with them and the best thing about me teaching someone is I always learn something in the process and just by taking him on as an apprentice even if it's for a week or two this is going to help me better myself in this case as a youtuber but I just wanted to share that information this video will probably go out today it's Monday you know, I don't even know the date. I know it's uh, midway through August. So, I'll have this listed on the channel as channel update with today's date on it. And other than that, I'm going to do a small test video with this lens walking. So, I'll make sure the image stabilization is on, autofocus is on. And I'll just walk, see how this comes out. This is a 10 to 18 millimeter ultra wide angle. I had forgotten I've even bought this lens. I did a few tests with it and decided it wasn't really that fantastic. Be good for doing an indoor event, that'd be about it. Now I'm thinking it's probably going to be a pretty good lens for vlogging. So. I might not use the fisheye as much anymore, but I still love the lens. And we'll just see how it goes. I'm gonna put a small joke video at the end of this just because I couldn't resist making it. So if you take offense to it, that's all right. I just wanted to give someone a laugh and I know my sense of humor doesn't work with everyone. Later and bye. Today's video is sponsored by Canadian Lawn Munching Service. Featuring Goose and his crew. For a good clean lawn, call Goose, Canadian Lawn Munching Service. I hope you liked my little uh, sponsorship joke video. It was meant to be fun. As always, please like, please subscribe, and please consider sharing a video or two of mine. It helps the channel, and the more the channel grows, the more I can do to help you. Later, bye.